You ready? Ready for what? We're gonna adjust you. Adjust me. <laughs> oh, call 911. <laughs> so you saying to me, when I walk up out of here, I'm gonna be walking, I ain't gonna be walking like a fat lady. Ooh, lean with it, roll with it, bounce with it. Oh, my neck, my back, all the way to my crack. <laughs> he did his thing to keep the cane today. Miss Marquita, coming all the way from St. Louis. She doesn't even know what's going on right now. Right. They flew all the way from St. Louis to come here. So thank you so much. Thank you. Sir. Thank yeah. You're here together. <laughs> um, this is a chiropractic appointment. What? Yeah. Not no crab ragu. Do it. <laughs> <laughs> if I if I had some, I'd share with you right all now. All right. But she did it because I imagine she knows that you're feeling pretty rough. All right, so, uh, surprise. <laughs> Happy birthday. Thank you. <laughs> and now we are going to get you adjusted. We're gonna see how you're doing and how your body's doing. And so what's bothering you, what's hurting on you? When I sleep, my back hurts. I have a toss and turn all through the night. Wow. You know, trying to position myself. In June, I had got shingles. Oh, wow. And I had thought shingles was for old people. Mm. But then when I realized I was 60, close to 60, <laughs> I'm like, oh, that's, that would be me. <laughs> but it's still, you know, going on even today. Yeah. And what I have been doing is putting Biofreeze on it uh -huh. because they had gave me some gapapentin. Yeah, 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 and they knocked me out, so it was too strong. And mm. It didn't do nothing for that shingles. Yeah. So do you sell shingles right now? Yes, I no. still have. I don't have it right now, but I'm saying like when I get stressed out. I still like irritated. you see like the exacerbation. Yeah, the, I feel the burning sensation of. It. Yeah. So where did you have shingles at? Uh, my back, all around the the back area. Okay. So if I were to touch it, would it be too sensitive to? No, no? It, I okay. mean it's been since June. Mm. So it's been okay. So right. like symptom, like skin wise, you don't see it anymore. It's I just mean, like, no, you don't see nothing. Yeah, it's just the um, the, the residual yeah. effect. Yeah. Right. Okay. So and that's what I think uh, more than anything is that we want to try to help you relieve some of that pain that you've been going through. Okay. Right. The the back stuff. Right. Neck pain too. Just a little bit. You said. Yeah. Sometimes I had you know back pain and I was you know diagnosing myself saying that because of the way I sleep. You know. Mm -hmm. How do you sleep? Side, back, so stomach. Carefully. I'm telling you, I sit <laughs> like a fish out of water. <laughs> <laughs> I just ain't no certain way. I, and I mean, that's the thing. Like, we want to make sure that your body is doing the right things, right? So that you can continue to feel better, mm -hmm. right? So there's going to be a lot of times where you get adjusted or you just start to feel better. And then when you sleep and you are just tossing and turning everywhere and you're like this, mm -hmm. right? You're going to be there for three to a couple hours, whatever. And then you're like messing up your body more too. Mm -hmm. So we try to tell people either you sleep on your back or your side, right? This can be the best way to do it. Mm -hmm. uh, put a pillow in between your knees. Try to keep your head as neutral as possible. Don't be like this mm -hmm. or like this so that your body can take it, right? Mm -hmm. So you ready? Ready for what? We're gonna adjust you. Yeah? Adjust me. Yeah, okay, adjust we're gonna me. crack your, like have you, seen, have you seen anybody ever crack like, um, <laughs> Like crack your bones, like it's not we're not actually cracking. Yeah, your bones. on TV when they playing with people, but not. No, no, no. So we're not gonna kill you, right? No, you're not. Okay. Yeah. So we're gonna, we're not gonna, we're gonna like adjust you. We're gonna do, we're gonna do good things for you, okay. right? So that your body can start to feel better. You know, what we're trying to do is just really loosen up a lot more of the joints, so let your body to just calm down a lot more, because right now it's in a very hypersensitive state. Okay. All right. Well, wait a minute. She told me, Miss Molly told me that. It's because I'm fat. I'm having all these problems. No. Well, she no. said it. She blamed it on the fat. What? <laughs> she blamed it on the belly. She said, you eat too much. Uh, so. I said, that's why you're so tired. This. Walking is not going to. Yeah. Well, I think, honestly, a part of it, of you feeling tired and feeling in pain and whatnot, a lot of it can come from your body just not being able to heal. Mm -hmm. So do we want to act this like as a facilitator more than anything? So what about you having a, a pacemaker and a defibrillator? Uh, it's not going to affect it whatsoever, mm -hmm. right? I think this part might just be a little bit tighter just because of how stiff and, like, you know, you had to have that surgery to open it up, right? Okay. But I think that's the only limitation we'll probably see right now. But everything else, you should be good. So you saying to me, when I walk up out of here, I'm gonna be walking, I ain't gonna be walking like a fat lady. <laughs> 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 I 
<laughs> well, I mean, um, I, th- I, don't, <laughs> I, I'm, I know you're joking. I'm just, I, I think that you're going to have a lot of improvement okay. walking outside of here. I think, you know, there's some things that we see in your spine that are just limitations, I mm-hmm. should say, that I can't get it passed over. Mm-hmm. But there's going to be different things that you can continue to improve on even more. Okay. So is this something I have to do more than once, or this a one-time win? So today, today it's a one-time thing, right? But okay. at some point, like you'd want to start doing some more adjustments on you, especially mm-hmm. if you get good results. But even just like small walking, like walking backwards is great, mm-hmm. walking forwards is great. Like just small exercises like that, I think, is the best thing. Okay. All right. Cool. I'm Gucci. I'm yeah, Gucci. Let's do it. <laughs> All right. So um, we're gonna do a few checks on you. All right, and then we'll see how we're doing. So. Slowly turn your head to the right. This right? Yes. Any pain when you do that? Mm, no. No? So I just want to point something out. So your nose is about like 70 degrees here. Mm-hmm. And ideally you want to be closer to 90. So to look all the way back in that bag. Right. We don't want you to force it, but you yeah, can. But yeah, but yeah, I feel the stretch. Yeah. Look to the left now. Yeah, so I can see you trying, right? Mm-hmm. And I can feel your shoulder elevated and everything. Any pain when you go to the left or to the right? More to the right. More to the right? But I don't yeah. know if it's pain or stiffness, you know. So. Yeah, so I mean, they could still be like the same thing. Look mm-hmm. straight. Let's have you look all the way up to the ceiling for me. Good, any pain there? Mm-hmm. Okay, look all the way down. Any pain there? Nope. Okay, stand up now for me too. Oh, here we go. All right. Does it hurt getting up like that? Yes. Yeah. Where do you feel the pain when you do that? All uh, oh, in here. All in there. Okay. Move forward just a tad and try and touch your toes. All right. Is that painful at all when you do that? I don't know if it's painful or regular because it's just not right. It's too much. It's overwhelming. Sure. Come stand back up. Yeah. So you're having to walk yourself up because there's definitely some pain. I think your body's just been so used to doing this mm-hmm. for so long that you just doesn't know what it's supposed to be like and what it is like, okay. right? Um, let's have you walk outside. I just want to see how your body walk, like how you walk. Okay. So when you're walking, does it hurt? Yeah, it, it, it's overwhelming. It's too much. So is this the, normally the pace, the speed that you walk at? Yes, and then I sit down like for 10 minutes. I can only walk a certain amount of steps. Mm. And then I sit down because I get short of breath. Wow. And, uh, it just feel like something pulling, like the heaviness. Yeah. So it's, it's miserable, like going wow. to the grocery store. All of that, I be looking for the first cart. When I go in places, I be eyeballing that tallest chair. Yeah. Because uh, it's too much to like sit down low. Mm-hmm. Then you gotta rock yourself up. Yeah. And when I go to the store to sit in the car or something, I have to wait a while before I get out. It's like I got to get ready to get up. Mm. So I have to start with my mind. Got it. So when you're walking, right, what are you feeling when you're walking? I feel uh, heaviness. Heaviness more on the right side or the left side? <laughs> Both sides. Both sides. Okay. Yeah, I just feel too much. Yeah, so if we can, like, we're seeing, like, her just kind of drag. Yeah. Her I'm... foot almost, like... It's like you're planting and then dragging. I don't think you realize like which ones you're doing just right now. Uh, go face down into the table now for me. Mm-hmm. My back, lower back. It hurts right now? Mm-hmm. Okay. Keep the left leg straight for me and lift it up as high as you can go. The, your whole leg, your whole left leg. So, yep, just like that. And then go back down and then do this side too. It's, is that side tougher for you? The left is more tougher. The left is much tougher. Sure. Both, both of them are tough, yeah? We're gonna go nice and easy down here, okay? We're gonna go just a few of them. Because your body has just been so stiff and so not used to doing this. So when it goes down, is it getting easier? I feel like it, but okay. I don't think I'm doing it. Yeah, just... Try to keep your head down as much as you can. Try to relax it as much as you can. I know. How's it feeling? I feel like it's getting better with time. The right knee. Right knee's hurting a little bit? Yeah. So we got a lot to work on, right? 
So you can feel like this little ball right here mm -hmm. compared to this one and there's nothing here. So this seems like a lot of fluid mm -hmm. that's been in here. Oh yeah, it's all. I'm gonna go right through your hamstring, okay? Mm -hmm. Try and relax that a little bit more in through here. Good, I'm gonna go right through here too. It's gonna be easy on you, okay? So when it goes down now, how does that feel? I feel like it's going down. Is it just as painful or is it easier? It's easier. Good, all right. We're just seeing a little bit of movement, mm -hmm. right? And that's really what we're trying to do. We're trying to create some movement in there, especially like since your body hasn't been used to a lot of this. Right. And we want some stretching. We want some opening to be in there because, you know, You've been walking and hobbling a lot. There hasn't been any movement the way that they're supposed to be. And it's causing you to have some pain. I'm gonna lock these in a little bit here more. You'll feel a bigger stretch. But we wanted to start off with that. Ready? Feel that stretch more? I feel the knee. On your knee? I'm not pain when I leave. Is that easier? Mm-hmm. Good. Keep the left leg straight again, and let's lift it up again. Beautiful, how does that feel? Better. That's a lot better, yeah? Yeah. And then go do the right side now. That's a little bit better, right? Mm -hmm. Still not as good, <laughs> but we're getting there. Yeah. Little by little. So that's why your, uh, your daughter decided to buy it, or bring it here, huh? Yes. Okay, so we're seeing on your x-rays that this hip is just a little bit too far low like this, mm -hmm. all right? So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna be pushing in like this, in here to try and help this out, okay? So this table's gonna pop up underneath of you. Here we are. Ooh. Yeah. That's why, that's why I try to kind of warn you, you know what I mean? Yeah. All right. And I'm gonna go right in through here, right in through this part that's been hurting. Painful? You're okay. You'll get through it. <laughs> Easier? Mm-hmm. You don't know. <laughs> now, let's try that again. Uh, left leg all the way up again, here. Good, and the right side. There you go, how does that feel? Amazing. Yeah. <laughs> and so what we're gonna do is take this and push down on this here, because of how stiff this is here. Ready? Good. Not bad, right? Good. Awesome. Now, left leg up again. Beautiful. How are you feeling? Amazing. Yeah, and the right side. Yes, that is night and day. Like compared to where it was before. Yeah. That is so good. <laughs> Just a little bit more, okay? okay? Lift this up again. And back down, good. So her hips are really like off-center. This right side was a lot further down, the left side was a lot further up. And we're trying to level it out so that she can feel better. And actually be able to get some sleep and actually walk, you know what I mean? Walking is a pretty big uh, thing. <laughs> One more time, left the left leg all the way up again. Amazing. Any pain? No. And the right side. Amazing. Any pain? No. How does that feel compared to the last time, you, the first time you did it? It feel like it's been like a fake, but since it's me, I know it's not fake. So with that being said, and I know this is happening for real because it's me. Mm-hmm. I know I'm not getting paid to lie. <laughs> so amazing. Every, every everyone thinks that we have actors. Well, I'm an actor, but not like this good actor. Like <laughs> this is for real. She said she came in. She said she was a star. You are a star. Uh -huh. <laughs> Your lower back has this little bit of a curve here, and I'm gonna take that curve out. Okay. Right? I feel nothing. <laughs> and we're gonna go right in through 
here again. Good. All right. So what I want to do, I'm going to see how your body just kind of works and see if it pulls, if it doesn't. See how easy this one is? Mm -hmm. This one's like, no, we're not that easy. So I'm going to pull a little bit on here. Look at these shoes. Here. Oh! What the heck? <laughs> <laughs> He's still got a leg. It's actually over here. <laughs> but now, lift this leg up, see how it is. Yeah, and the right side. Beautiful. You're a ballerina now. Yeah, ballerina with one leg. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's have you sit up and face towards Ken now. Oh, for me. Let me see if I can remember how to sit up. <laughs> Walk oh. yourself up nice and easy, okay? Oh, I'm gonna have to. <laughs> Wait a minute. Take your time. Take your time. I ain't you got no rush. choice. <laughs> I don't know how to get up. I got you. <laughs> oh, Lord. How are you doing? I don't know. I'll tell you in a minute. Okay. <laughs> My defibrillator, that's not upside down, is it? No, it's on the left side. Oh, okay. Yeah? I guess. Mm -hmm. Help me, please, help me, please. <laughs> Man. Okay, so what, what's up, what's up? What? <laughs> I want you, let's stand up again. I just wanna see. I wanna see too. Go ahead. I wanna you walk down the hall. All right. Yes. I wanna, wanna walk, walk it like a talking. You wanna walk? what I'm supposed to be walking like. That's exactly how you're supposed to be walking like. Man, where you been all my life? <laughs> <laughs> oh, shoot. <laughs> oh, man, not the fat girl walk. No, you're actually walking. Oh, my God, this is amazing. St. Louis. Yes. <laughs> Holla. <laughs> Holla at the doctor. <laughs> oh, man. How long is this gonna last? I just gonna last. You just gotta now that now that you can walk, right? You just oh. have to keep walking. Oh man. We got a couple more things we gotta do with you though. Oh right? here we go. Okay. We gotta fix your neck too. Oh man. Yeah. I mean think right? You have to trust me now. I mean look at you, you I just mean, walked. I mean that's so amazing if you don't yank the hell out of me. <laughs> it's not popping rocket. Yeah. See now you can you know you'll be able to I heard you had some bad Mexican food the other day. Oh man, it wasn't bad, it wasn't good. <laughs> Everything tastes the same. That's not a good Mexican size, that. Oh, 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 oh. We came all the way from St. Louis to get nachos, tacos, <laughs> and Mexican pizza, and it all got the same ingredients and tastes the same. Oh, no. Who does that? You, you, got, to, you got to the wrong place. You got that right. I was talking to your daughter about this place called Tacos Los Cholos. Mm -hmm. And Ken, is it good? Oh, yeah. It's phenomenal. I wish I'd have saw y'all yesterday. I could have helped y'all out. She bought everything on the menu for me. And I'm like, oh my God, this just stopped. Only thing good is the soda. And then I asked for a refill and it tasted like salsa. <laughs> I'm like, oh my God, I should have stopped while I was ahead. Living and learn, I guess, right? Oh yeah. Dang, you know this hurt. Yeah, but now look to the right again. What's up? What were you noticing? I know what it said. It went smooth and easy. <laughs> Look to the left. Mm. Yeah. You to my right, you to my left. You gonna stay there. <laughs> Do you get any headaches, migraines, anything like that? No. I'm not really. I got rid of my husband a long time ago. <laughs> <laughs> Look all the way down. Tell me which is harder. Look to the right from here. Right there. As much as you can. Okay. I can go to the left now. Oh, they look both pretty good. Right. Yeah, right? I tried to told you. <laughs> and let's see here. We're going to go right there. And let's go right here. A little bit right there. A little tight, you feel? Yeah. Okay. Do me a favor. Scoot to your right over here. All right. I'm going to climb behind you. 
<laughs> now, her uh, daughter didn't show her any of the videos when she was supposed to. She, she was like, I was, gonna, I was gonna show her the videos when we were on the plane, I totally forgot. So, we're gonna adjust you, all right? Are you wearing any makeup or anything? No, I'm a natural no. beauty. That's why you're so gorgeous. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What, 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 whoa, what you gonna I'm do? Gonna right now? I'm gonna place my hand around, and I'm just gonna adjust this part here, okay? Mm -hmm. All right. Switch button. Lay back on my leg here. So this is C2, which is just a little bit on top of this bone. Loosen the neck more. That's it. Right there. Good. Yeah. <laughs> Woo! Help me. <laughs> what was that about? <laughs> the nutcracker? Yeah. <laughs> good thing you smell good. Thank you. People always wonder, they're like, does he smell musty? Oh no, I'm like, glad I hope not. He smells good enough to eat. Oh. <laughs> but I don't want to make it food. All right. Let's look to the left again. Okay, what's my left? This one. All right, I forgot. Yeah, that's good. Look to the right. Yeah, that's good too. Look straight. I don't think if she would have shown me this on a plane, I'd be not having no man climbing on my back. <laughs> <laughs> That's maybe maybe it was better that she yeah, forgot. Yeah? Right. All right. So we're gonna adjust now um, this left side. All right. And I'm going to just use my hands here this time. Mm -hmm. Relax there more. You can feel that right here. Bend your head down more. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. What the hell? <laughs> <laughs> That was real good. Now, one more time. Look to the right again. Beautiful. Left. Beautiful. How are you feeling? Man, I feel like a new woman. I yeah. just don't want to wake up if it's going <laughs> to go away. No, we, we got one more, all right? Okay. We have to decompress the rest of your spine. Okay. So I want you to lay on your back. So, here. so when you took the x-rays, what did you see? So on the x-rays, what we saw, was this. So there's a defibrillator one. Um, so this is, remember the hips that I was saying kind of, this is your hips here. And when we look at a hip and we see your hips, we should see this. So you see how it's not level, this is your hip right there. Mm -hmm. So it should look something more like, like this. So you see how the hips are level? Mm -hmm. Yours is coming down mm -hmm. like this a lot. So because of it, it was causing a lot of the pelvic dysfunction in your body, causing you to have a lot of that pain. Mm -hmm. And that's why it was hard for you to do anything. So what caused it to be shifted like that? There's no specific reason. Mm -hmm. could, sometimes pregnancy makes it start, mm -hmm. right? Sometimes just the way that you sleep for long periods of time, the way that you sit, just all, it's just a cumulative thing, mm -hmm. right? It can just be for whatever reason and just causes your body to just turn a certain way. And when that happens, that's when you start to have some issues there. Okay. Right? So what we did here is just basically turn this back forward up and try to level it out. Mm -hmm. That's why you were walking down, mm -hmm. like Nelly going down all the way down <laughs> <and coming back. laughs> Yes. Yeah, and then your neck. So this is your neck here. So the biggest thing that we saw about your neck is just this part here. This is normal on the right. You see this little beak looking thing down here? Mm -hmm. That shouldn't be there. Meaning that there's just been a lot of pressure right there on the bottom of your neck. Mm -hmm. And so what we want to do is just open it back mm -hmm. the opposite way that way. So that's what you just did? That's what we just did. So what about you no know, this? You know, I ain't got no problem with no this. Um, so this part here, you might have a little bit of an issue with the disc where it's starting to close off, mm -hmm. right? We do have a block here and we recommend that you just lay on it every single day, mm -hmm. but also standing up more and starting to walk more, that's going to be the best thing for you. Um, there is actually one, I think this is honestly the biggest reason why your lower back hurts too, mm -hmm. is because, see this here, mm -hmm. you see this here, mm -hmm. you don't really have a disc in that lower back. So where can I get one from? <laughs> so you can try to hydrate just a little bit more by walking more and drinking a lot more water mm -hmm. so it stays like that. But we want to make sure that it doesn't compress anymore. So walking more, right? Allowing your body to feel like the ground again. And I think it was tough before, it's just that you just couldn't walk, mm -hmm. right? So we just wanted to be able to facilitate that walking so your body can do better. Okay. All right. So walking will fix the disc problem. Walking will fix the hip problem and mm -hmm. allow your disc to become 
healthier okay. than it has been now. But nothing else I could do about it. No, the, and that's the thing. Like the best thing, the best absolutely thing that you can do is just be moving. Okay, right? keep that's the most. Moving. Yeah, because you want to build strength in your legs. You want to build strength in your back. Mm -hmm. The worst thing you can do is absolutely nothing, right? And we don't want you to have any surgeries or anything like that too. So the only way you get surgeries is if you do nothing about it. So what about I've been taking water aerobics. Yeah, that's great. That's great because it takes it takes pain away from that lower back, right? Mm -hmm. And especially even after this adjustment today, like mm -hmm. if you're actually able to walk, the water aerobics should help even more so because mm -hmm. now you'll build a different type of strength. Let's do this. I want you to lay on your back. So I am going to open up this mid back a little bit too. Lay all the way back. Good. Drop the head more. Mm -hmm. See it pops? Mm -hmm. All right. Ooh. Wow. Beautiful. Yeah. Take a breath, see how your body feels. I got anything to drink? Yes. You want some water? No, I want some more gin and juice. Yeah. <laughs> I don't drink, but I will take some water. Yeah. Let me grab you some water. Oh my god. Call 911. <laughs> So what I'm gonna do next is we're gonna decompress your spine and we're gonna allow your body just to open more. Good, good, good. Do I get to keep the x-rays? You can take a picture of them. Okay. Yeah, that'd be better. And down now. Oh man, don't tell me you're gonna snatch my neck off. Yeah. Oh, heck no. Nice, and not, not a lot, just a little snatching. Mm. We're snatching your head off, so, you know. You can walk down again. Take a deep breath in through your nose and out through your mouth. Deep breath in and out. Put your hands on your stomach for me. That's better, right there. Oh! The hell? Oh my god. Is my neck bleeding? No. Ooh, lovely. Oh shoot, it's not scary. <laughs> oh my god. Don't move. Just let your body just kind of relax here first. I ain't got no choice. Yeah. Mm. Oh my god. What are you feeling? I feel all kind of ways. <laughs> all right, let's see what, what, what. What's that? What, what next? That's it. Oh my God, is anything left? I don't think so. Okay, let me see if I still got a neck. Yes. You wanna sit up? Yeah, I wanna sit yeah. up. Grab my hand. I hope you didn't mess up my walk. Yeah. Oh my God, have mercy. How's that neck feel? I don't know how nothing feel. I just feel different completely. That's, that's a good thing, right? Well, sometimes, you know, when they tell you when you go to church, they say come out better than you was when you came in. Yeah. I feel like I came out better. Good. But I want to make sure when I walk out the door, it's, I'm still good. Yeah? You want to try to walk again? Yeah. All right. Oh, my neck, my back, <laughs> all the way to my crack. <laughs> <laughs> You're walking good. Wow. wow. <laughs> I just, just don't feel real. No. You see how I walk better? I don't know how you don't wobble. Right, that fat girl walk. <laughs> like, like a penguin. Where my stuff was dislocated. And he said it had nothing to do with fat. It was the Mexican food. Yes. And I just, <laughs> okay. All right. How are you feeling? Ooh, let me get this next situation out of control. <sighs> You look great. Oh man, Phenomenal. what you think? What you think, Mr. Camberman? <laughs> you just seen a miracle today. Yeah. You just seen a miracle, so. What your yeah. name is? I'm Dr. Tubio. I never heard of him, don't know him. <laughs> but uh, he did his thing to Keita Kane today. St. Louis in the house. St. Louis in the house, I appreciate oh, you. Oh man, I appreciate you too. You did awesome. So, uh, I have to uh, represent, so okay. them shirts you got up there. Yeah. Could I get a discount? I want to sure. buy me one and her one. Yeah, I guess you one. Normally they're fifty. I'll give it to you for twenty-five. Okay, for both of them, because I got to get her one for buying. Yeah. Absolutely. I mean, bringing me here, because yeah, I, I got to represent, because big sexy coming back. 
<laughs> All right, you tell your girls to hook it up. Oh, I, I got you. Woo, y'all, this is amazing man right here. I love the man to crawl on my back. <laughs> <laughs> Give me a hug. I, I just appreciate need... you. I love right, you. Thank you. Thank you so much. I love hey. your energy. Make sure you uh yeah. see me at no. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.